turned in here tonight. That is what they will be. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times. Enter Bruce Lee. I mean, that's Bruce Lee in a nutshell. Over and over and over, he did the same thing, and it shows in the technique because there's no wasted energy. There's no wasted movements. Everything he does, he does with a purpose. He goes in there with an idea of what he's trying to accomplish, and he gets it done. Bruce Lee is the absolute best. Bruce Lee is the man. His grappling, his takedown defense figure to be tested here tonight. There aren't that many guys who are going to want to stand and trade on a napkin in the center of the octagon with the great Bruce Lee. No, if you're fighting Bruce Lee, you're shooting for takedowns right yeah. away. Bruce Lee, ladies and gentlemen, Bruce effing Lee. We are set for our main event of the evening. And now our kill the take for this lightweight scrap. Here is Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> Herb Dean, third man Ready, in the octagon fight. for this one. Ready. Good. Well, what a visual this is. Bruce Lee ready to go for round one, the founding father of modern mixed martial arts. It's hard to simulate his speed and his striking in training, and I think that's something that has been a big focus for the opponent coming in here tonight. Quick with his hands, quick with his feet, and obviously a guy who gets off to a very good start more often than not. Bruce Lee ready to go for round one. Gonna shut your body off. Nice jab. Big knee. Shows him the left and then follows it up with a right. Nice one two punch there by Lee. Can't feel good. So a nice job landing the counter there, and that's really bring him over the top. This fight's gonna be over this. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high when his opponent thought he was going low, and now he's got him hurt very badly. Oh, nice right in. Oh my goodness. Process, folks. Here we go. Edge of your seat action right out of the shoot. These dudes are trading very early in this fight. This is good. Front kick by Lee. Good jab. Two minutes have expired in our opening round. That kick blocked by Lee. And now some separation. Well, champ, I don't see that well, but it's hard to miss the redness underneath that elbow. A lot of bodily investment from his opponent tonight. Yeah, it's an investment. John, it may not pay dividends right now, but the more you go there, the more damage you do, eventually it will show itself. Right now it's starting to show. Oh, and he lands another pinpoint counter. He has done an excellent job seemingly all night, remaining patient, waiting for his opponent to strike first. Huge connection by him there. He needs to get on his bicycle, John. He needs to get into space so that he doesn't get finished. Nice. 
Under two minutes now to go in round one. Effective with the jab. That was nice strike. All right, he gets the takedown now, DC. We'll see what he can do in this advantageous spot. He set it up beautifully. Let's oh. see if he can now take full advantage of it. Oh, that's how you do it. Postures up and lands to the head. Oh, great reversal to top position by Lee. And he's back up. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. Oh, big Superman punch there! Out of range with that one. Under a minute now to go in the round. Oh, made good use of his size there as he lands the flush knee. So now we start to see some redness underneath the elbow. You got to think he's going to continue to attack the body with all of his strikes. Whoa. Oh, picture perfect shot there, DC. And one more of those, he might be out. I mean, the fight is going to be over. I can't believe he's still standing. That shot landed perfect. Oh, and he lands yet another knee. And sometimes it pays to be the taller fighter, DC. I know you can't necessarily relate. Oh, nice job to land a knee to the body. Man, I wish I was that tall. 20 seconds now to go. Oh, single power tie here. Final seconds here of round one. That horn sounds means we have reached the end of round one. Well, I'm not sure the extent to which he has recovered, but we do see the end of the round. DC, talk us through the replay. Well, he's a tough guy. He's going to make it to the stool. He's going to survive unless you put him completely out of there. Unfortunately, he's in there with a guy that does have that ability. You ready? You ready? Go. All right, round two. All right, here we go. This next round is underway. He got... <laughs> You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Well, no denying that he rocked him, but couldn't quite get the finish. He hurt him real bad, but he couldn't find the shot that would put him to sleep. He threw a lot of punches, but he couldn't get the one to land on the button that would end the night. Head kick partially blocked. Leading now, nasty cut on his nose. Fighter lands a jab. Oh, they're trading huge shots here. We'll see who's the last man standing. Oh, that's big. Oh, looking to land the leg kick, but unable to find the target. Now lands a solid punch there. It's okay. Keep Just going. misses with the jab there. Oh, massive overhand lands. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Well, not much of a setup there. Misses with the left hook. Back and forth we go. Beautiful strike there as he continues to attack that cut. Cut man's gonna have some work to do if we get to the stool between rounds. But that's why we got the best in the business. We got the best cut men in the business, and they are going to need him right now because this cut is getting worse, and it's only gonna continue to get worse because he has got a killer in front of him. Three minutes to go in round two. Well, this fight's been pretty crazy thus far. Both guys doling out a lot of damage, and neither seems too bothered by it, but clearly both parties are hurt. Both guys are hurt. Both guys are fighting beautifully. 
Both are showing a lot of heart right now in this fight. They're both doing amazing jobs. Let oh, what a connection by him there. His opponent could be out of here soon, DC. He's almost done. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, you don't know whether to run, hide, grab, or wrestle. He's a, he, I mean, he's confused. He's as confused as he was on his first test in elementary school. Oh, thought he might have had that head kick, but just out of range. Well, the more things change, the more they stay the same. He continues to land a high volume of strikes on his opponent at will. Well, I mean, John, the guy can fight everywhere. And he can fight everywhere, meaning he can fight on the ground. He can fight in the stand-up. But he's also able to do it because his cardio is so good. Right. This is one of the best fighters that we have seen for a long time. And it is showing in this performance. Uh, lands a good series of kicks there, DC. It really didn't take him long to get a good beat on his opponent. He figured the timing, and now he's been driving kick after kick into his opponent. Strike lands clean. Well, as soon as he goes with that high guard, he pays for it to the body. You see the bruises really starting to accumulate now. In the beginning of the fight, you think, I gotta protect my head at all costs. Right now, I believe that this guy has to worry about his body. Look at how red the side of his body is. He's got to change something. Looking to land the right just out of range. So a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here, and as a result, has really picked up the pace in round two. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's going to be over very soon. Lee's all sorts of bruised up on his body. That is gonna hurt something fierce tomorrow. Well, now these kicks are really starting to pile up since he found his range. This could be trouble. Oh, here's the head kick is blocked. 20 seconds to go round two. Lee's nose is bleeding now. Yes, looks as though he got cut by one of those offerings from his opponent. Oh! Both tough, both durable, both unwilling to take a step back. What a phenomenal fight. Oh. Holy smokes! All right, back to the stools now, and he is no longer the handsome man we once knew. That gash is getting serious. Stupid. All right, so as the cut man gets to work, we'll re-rack some replays from the previous round. Well, he's got some work to do. The cut man's going to have to work a miracle because this guy was on the receiving end of some real damaging shots. And if he doesn't do something different defensively, it's going to get worse. And if it gets worse, the fight may be stopped. You ready to fight? Ready. Third yeah. round underway. Lands a jab. Man, that cut has really opened up. Oh, and he tags him with the straight. Beautifully placed there by Lee. Pretty good execution for him there on the sidekick, DC. Just really feeling himself. One of those traditional martial arts techniques that are making their way to the UFC's octagon. What a fight, what a display of physical and mental toughness on both sides. I'm not sure who's more injured, but they're both hurting for sure. Yeah, John, they're both beat up, but I think that is the key. The mental is what's going to allow you to get your hand raised in this fight. This will not be easy. You're going to have to go to some dark places whenever you're in front of a guy. All right, well, the ref's going to step in here. He has done a job on his nose. You see what I did there, nose shot? <laughs> but, John... It's a bloody nose. We've all had bloody noses. We got bloody noses in our first fight at seven years old. So I'm, I'm pretty sure they'll let him keep fighting. Doctor talking to the referee and as if to say, I've seen worse. Wow. Fight's going to continue the fans' love. This dude chose violence <laughs> when he showed up to work today. Ready to fight. Ready. 
All right, so the ref will get the action back on the way after that brief health and safety check. And to no one's surprise, the fans support the decision for the action to continue. Absolutely. I mean, this official decided you can go. Even though at times the fighter may question whether or not he can do it, we have very smart ringside officials that make a determination. And... Oh! oh, he's wobbled now. Oh, he lands a massive kick here. Oh! He missed with that jab attempt there. Well, when you're dealing with a cut like that, it may not be long before it starts to impact the breathing. Not a good spot to be in here. Stunned, trying to recover here. Oh, big left hook there! Three minutes to go in round three. Well, he misses with the left punch there. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Big head kick. Nice entry there, and able to finish. But he needs to check one of these kicks. He has to discourage him from throwing this kick over and over again. All right, let's go, let's go. Keep your hands oh, nice kick. Oh, man, the blood is flowing now. I know a lot of you like that, but he has got to figure some things out defensively or this fight's going to end. He's got to move his head, John. But the problem is, now he's got the blood to deal with. He's got a sharp striker in front of him. He has got a lot of things to deal with if he wants to win this fight. But right now, the focus needs to be on the head movement so you're not getting hit in that cut. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it was coming high, and now he's got him hurt bad. Oh, big roundhouse attempt, but unable to land. Another hurt. He's hurt bad. Oh, these ground strikes are just brutal. Wow, he is landing time and time again on that cut. All right, working inside his opponent's guard here. You cannot sit in these jiu-jitsu guys' guard. And you can't have one arm in, one arm out. Guys can start throwing up legs, chasing triangles. If you're the bottom fighter, DC, what do you do? You got to move. You got to shrimp. You got to get up on a hip to try to move your opponent off of you or pull him down to close the space. Oh, we got blood now, folks. Doctor might need to step in shortly. We got a huge situation here. Oh, and he escapes up to his feet. Very nice. Nice uppercut on the inside there. Well, if body language is any indication, mentally he is not back in this fight after that knockdown earlier in the round. I mean, we thought the fight was over, so I guess it's a credit to him to still even be fighting. But he's got to do something different if he has any designs of winning this fight. Well, the crowd continues to react with every passing land, but if you're the referee or even the corner, somebody's got to get involved out with this. Somebody's got to do something. It's getting very uncomfortable to watch this, and as the crowd gets excited, there's also a little bit of that... Yeah. I don't want to see any more oh, oh. going on in their reactions. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship rounds. All right, so the fighter heads back to the stool, and man, that is a severe cut that he's dealing with. We'll see if they call in the ringside position. All right, well, defense wins championships, and perhaps he can shore some things up there. Here are some replays from the damaging previous round. Well, he's got to. He's got to change some things if he doesn't want this cut to get worse. But hats off to his opponent. His opponent found the target. His opponent knew exactly what he wanted to accomplish, and he got it done. He's got to continue down the path, in order to make the cut worse. Ready to fight? Ready. Four. We have arrived at the fourth round fight schedule for five five-minute rounds. Nice straight punch. He's just being more aggressive, and because he's being more aggressive and more loose with his strikes, he's landing.
Lands with the left. Blocked the strike there. Counters with an inside leg kick. Good job by Lee. All right, champ, starting to see some swelling upstairs now. He's taking way too many shots to the head. You got to move your head. You cannot be on a straight line. Otherwise, you will take shots, and that shot, and no shots, leads to your face starting to swell. Back and forth we go. Oh, man, that cut is just bleeding like crazy. I wouldn't be surprised to see a stoppage here. So the amount of blood, the amount of blood that is leaking from this guy. It's amazing that he's still standing. He has been beat up thoroughly. Tonight is not going to be his night. Shot blocked there by Lee. Nice strike. Leg kick. Well, missed on that one. And blocks the shot there. Just over three minutes to go. And he's back up. Win the scramble! Win the scramble! Moving his head pretty well defensively on the ground here. Lee's in half guard. There it is. Now he's going to bump. This is a terrible position. And he is back up to his feet. Whiffs on that offering. Oh, how good was that combo? He is really doing a nice job stringing his shots together now. He does a great job of getting that leg kick to the target. Killer, you saw it right there. He has a really good sidekick. He's so fast at doing that technique, and there is no tell when he attempts that certain strike. Oh, go. Oh, what a head kick there as he lands, and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about guns. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Oh, my goodness. Oh, the Superman punch lands. Well, he's looking for that left hand. Just out of range, though, with it. Oh, that right hand barely missed there. They got checked. It's messed up really bad. Back to his patented kicks here, but just out of range. Under a minute to go. He tries to take out the leg. Beautiful leg kick lands. Oh, goes to the switch kick and lands. That was masterfully done. It's such a fast action. You draw a reaction from your opponent, and that's when you find the target. Good stick. Well, don't get mad, get even, right? He got stunned by his opponent earlier in the round. He's clearly been losing since. Mentally, it appears as though he's checked out a little bit. A lot easier said than done. When his opponent has the power... Oh! 20 seconds to go. Kick. Ten seconds to go in round four. Oh, Buzzer sounds for the end of round four. Twenty minutes in the books. All right, there's the horn signifying the end of the round, and he heads back to the stool, and hopefully he can stay in this fight because that is a severe cut that he's dealing with right now. Let's get this fight.
All right, let us get you some replays from the damage in that previous round. Perhaps we can even isolate the shot that opened the cup. I mean, just some big shots landed over the course of that round. And he wasn't responsible defensively. He was trying to tough out way too many situations. You can't do that when you're fighting a guy like this. If he doesn't change something, he's going to find himself in trouble. You ready to fight? Ready. Here we go, fifth and final round. sure how many more of these his opponent can take. Massive shot that he lands. Great job. Lee gets tagged by that stiff jab. Oh, big knee there. Well, he keeps going back to the well with that left hand just out of range. Oh, roundhouse kick. Add that to his highlight reel. All right, so a knockdown. Oh, you got to keep pressing here. Could be the beginning of the end. Looks like that one landed. Beautiful body kick. Lee's taking aim at that cut right now, and hard to blame him, right? Might as well continue to target that area and see if you might get a referee or even a doctor to intervene here. Defensively responsible, nice block. Lee gets hit with that overhand. Those are big strikes. Nice punch here. Cardio looks great. He's still bouncing, he's still moving. He's still real confident. He's trying to set a trap here so he can engage and really spring in there with a couple of big strikes. Just over three minutes now to go in the fight. And he blocks the shot there. Well, you can sense the corner frustration. He has not had any answer for these body shots, and now you see the visible damage. Well, his coaches are one. Back to the feet. All right, so at this point, the ringside position would be well within his right to stop the fight as the referee calls for him once again. We get it. Toughness on full display, but this damage is too much. You gotta stop the fight. Yeah, and he wants to continue, but he will not be afforded that opportunity. So that is it. Fans don't like it, but the doctor has to protect the fighters. And here once more with the official decision is Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, the doctor has called a stop to this fight. Declaring the winner by TKO, Bruce. The Dragon Lee! Mixed martial arts royalty, folks. Bruce Lee, lighten up your living room tonight and giving this capacity crowd a whole lot to cheer about. You know he's going to get everyone's best shot, but more.